Here we go. What video are we on? Mondetech. Two people. Andrea and I had. All right, is your sound working? No, not yet. There's I What? What? Why are in the line? Why are in the line? I don't know. What are you talking about? Why are we in the line? Morning. Oh, yesterday? Why are we in the line? Miss Joey. Okay. Was it yesterday? Did you go on the computer and saw me? Mm, yes. Yeah, was it for okay, flag day? Was it for flag, yes. for flag day? Did I come? Oh. Yeah, flag day. Yesterday was flag day. I went live on YouTube and I said, it's National Flag Day. And I colored a picture of a flag. And I waved and I waved my American flag yesterday. I know. Uh, all right, Aya, uh, can you hear me? Yes. Tomorrow, we're making a unicorn. We're making a unicorn? Yeah, tomorrow we made it, you know. Well, that was the, that was the uh, merry-go-round horse. Yes, that was awesome. All right, today, I just didn't like what you put. I just like mine. Cute. Very cute. All right. Which ice cream cone do I want to eat this morning? Mm, what do I have to eat for? Mm. Oh. Orange or cherry? Mm. Oh. <laughs> there is a friend who's here today. Mm. I at A Y A T A Y A T A Y A T. A Y A T. A -Y -A -T. I at your ice cream looks so yummy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> there is the friend who's here today, and Andrea is. What is her name? A N D R E A. A N D R E A. A N D R E A. Andrea is here today. Let's fix your name. It's wearing off. My marker. I'll fix it right now with my marker. Because I don't know why. Maybe I touched it. <laughs> Letters. Yeah, I'm gonna go over the letters again and write it so it looks better. There we go. Looks a lot better. Darker. Today is Tuesday. Today is Tuesday. And the number is this one. Fifty-five. Oh, look, the brown is there, too. I, I, uh, what number is this day for the calendar? 1555. No. Hey, everybody concentrate. One in five is 15. 15. But let's count. Let's not skip any of the numbers. Oh, we can't barely see it because my balloons. There we go. Let's count to, can we count to 30? Yeah. Yeah, let's count to 30 without skipping. All right. One. Well, we're working with lots of numbers today. 
So let's get started with that. Um, Twelve. Twelve. I have two words to share with you today because we're going to work with these. Carnival words. and carnival. No, no. Thing. This word. This is a ride at the fair. Carnival? No, this is a ride. What is the picture showing? Do you know what that ride is called? I know. Yes, Andrea. The wheel. Ferris wheel. And there's the word Ferris wheel with the capital F. Wheel. Ferris is the first. That's a long word. Well, yeah, because it's two. It's one, two words. Ferris wheel. Look at that. It's a big circle. Have you I'm ever right now. That right now. Are you going to write it? Yeah. Oh, great. I'll hold it up there so you can see it. I don't want to see it. I don't want to see it. I just want to see it. I know. And. R? And. Two R's. F-E-R-R-I-S. And I? I-S. Uh-huh. And then the second word is wheel. W H I'm back. I'm sorry. I have to go back. Oh. What did you miss? Papa, I played gong. Who did? A giant ice cream Whoa. That's exciting. All right, that so Andrea. No, Andrea is actually trying to write the word Ferris wheel, which is very nice. I made it. Um, I made it. Let me see. Very good. All right. And the other word today is tickets. Tickets. So tickets. when you go to the fair or the carnival, usually they have you use tickets to pay. I, I, I got some tickets. Yeah, they say, okay, you need five tickets to ride the Ferris wheel. I got, I got two I tickets got, to ride the train. I got two rides. A, a choo choo train and a, and a Ferris wheel. Whoa, that's awesome. But the Ferris wheel first. Great. So this is the word tickets. Now we're going to work with math today with tickets. So Miss Julie gave you guys this paper. You see that with all the tickets? Yeah, where's yours? Do you have the did you print it? Whoa. Yeah, you got scissors on yet? Start cutting. Yes, I see. Start cutting. We're gonna count, we're gonna do a little math with the tickets together. All right, start cutting down the lines. We might not use all of them, but we'll use some of them. All of them. Well, you I don't have See, like this? Cut them in strips first, and then you can cut the, uh, the rectangles. So we're going to do, 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 do a little ticket math, because at the carnival, they sometimes have tickets, where you need five tickets to play the game, or five tickets to go on the choo-choo train ride. So we're going to try to do the tickets math ticket game together and these tickets have pictures on them ticket. okay good I job andrea keep going like this can you cut like on the line on the dotted line to do all yeah. the to do the rectangles so these tickets have pictures on them of some things at the fair so we'll talk a little bit about it and we'll do some math we'll add up the tickets yeah, we're going to take turns with the numbers. So look, there's popcorn on here. You may need three tickets to buy a popcorn. You may need five tickets to, to buy a balloon. One, one ticket to pet the pig. Tickets. Four tickets to get cat and candy. A million tickets to get Whoa, that's a lot. And candy. Are you cutting them apart, Andrea? Yeah. Okay, good. Come and candy one. 
Then we'll do a little math game with the tickets. Good job, Maya. Yeah. All right. I am gonna show you guys. I'm gonna show what I'm at. Right. What? I, what are you doing? They are small, but you guys can. One, one, one. Hello. Oh, oh, you see all these? You see all these tickets on that. I got more tickets than I'm selling. One ticket, one one dollar to five dollars for one fun toy. Whoa! All right, we're gonna do this together. We're gonna we are gonna do this together. Uh, I'm looking at oh, so we... one dollar for the sun sun. They all have a number one on them. Do you guys see that? They all have a number one. I don't know why they all have a number one, but we'll, we'll be okay. For the duck. I'm not gonna cut too much tickets. No, no, cut them if you can, because we're gonna say, I'm gonna say, you need three. You're gonna need three of them to go pet the pig. So you're gonna cut all of them. Where's the pig? But I can't do it all by myself. You're doing a great job. Oh, You're doing a great job. Oh, we have plenty of baby shots in here. And then, guys, what I'm doing is I am shaking myself. What did you just say to me? I'm what not shaking I... it by myself. Good. I'm glad. You can do it. You're good. I am sorting mine. We need a lot of tickets. For this. You usually do at the carnival. Usually they, it's a lot of money. Animal tickets, yes. Here and oh yeah? Candy. Yeah. Oh. I'm gonna cut that one. Can't, which one? Oh the cotton candy. I know for the Bunch of balloons. Balloons, yes. Oh, be careful. I'm always careful with scissors. Yeah, good job. Do you guys see like the animals? All the animals, one are for the petting one. Mm. Yes, some places you have pet it. Petting zoo, yeah, petting zoo. See, to pet the animals. I haven't been to one of those in a long time. Maybe I'll try. Yeah, maybe I'll go to one this summer sometime. And guess I have a lot of tickets right here. Yeah. All right, we're gonna. All right, are we done? One day. Nope. Not done yet. Not done. Okay, one more minute. I'm not I done. Okay. Five more minutes. I'm going to show you. Let me show you. Not five more minutes. That's too much. Okay. I have mine on a red piece of paper so you can see them. This is how I'm going to do it to show you the game. I have them in the black table. Well, I'm the just doing it on a red paper to show you. We're going to play a game with the tickets. All right. So. Game with the tickets? Yeah. I'm gonna, we're going to do a little math here. So, um, Andrea is going to look at the tickets and... We're going to call out what part of the fair we want to see. If we want to go see an animal or if hey, we want to I don't have any red paper. No, no, you don't need paper. This is just for me. Just so you can see my tickets, I put a piece of red paper. Okay. Because my whiteboard. Oh, yeah. I don't need one. No, you don't need any. We're not using a red I paper. I don't really need it. My any. whiteboard, my marker board is white, so you wouldn't be able to see my tickets. I just did it so you could see my tickets. All right, guys. We're gonna, we can count. We're going to so take we can... turns. We're going to take turns saying what we want to see at the carnival that are on the tickets, and we're going to add them up. Miss Julie's going to say a number, and we're going to add up how many tickets you would need to go see that. And if you have a grant, well, 
If you have a crayon or marker, you can do some math on a piece of paper. Let me see what I got here. Okay. You can write it on the back of this one. You guys, this one we're gonna do? With the, pa with the patterns, you guys can write on the back of it, okay? All right, all right, first one. I want to go see the baby ducks at the fair. So let's see how many tickets we have with the duck on it. How many tickets it's going to cost to go see the ducks? Um, one, two, three, no, no, no. Four, four. Andrea, look yeah. at your ducks in front of you. Andrea, look at the ducks in front of you. And I add you two. Aunt, how many tickets do you have to have ducks? I have two and I have Let two. I think it's just two. I just have two. 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 Have two ducks. All right. Everybody has two. Okay. Two ducks. Two. There's they're two. They're both twins. They're both twins. Awesome. Maybe they're twins like my girls. Okay. So first stop at the fair we're going to see is the ducks. Now as two. So we're going to, that wasn't a lot of tickets. We're going to go see the other animal next to them too. We're going to go see the pig. Let's see how many tickets it costs to see the pig. How many pig tickets do you have, Andrea? Look at uh, yeah, I don't have any pig tickets. It looks like this, Ayat. Oh, pig, that like a cat. Piggy. What do you think it is? It's a pig. It's a pig. It's a pig. It's a pig. Lion? No, pig. We're gonna go see the pigs. The pigs are can be next to the ducks. Yeah, this one. Yeah, we're not seeing the lions. They would eat the ducks. We gotta go. We're going to the pig area first. Is this, is this two pigs. There's two pigs. Okay, two pigs and two ducks. So how many is that all together? So it's gonna be two pigs, two ducks. Four. Four. So this is the math problem. Two pigs plus two duck animals. Four tickets. Four tickets. That is the how many tickets you would need to go visit the ducks and the pigs together. Two plus two. I found one piggy. You found one more? How did you, how did you find three? I only had two. I have two after all. Yeah, two ducks and two pigs. So we would need four tickets to go see those animals. All right, that's a good one. Okay, now, where do you want to go next after the animals, Ayat? Look at I your- want the, I want to get some balls. Some balls, oh, oh, that's a good one. Okay, so how many balls? How two. Many? There's two. Okay, so two balls. Those are fries. That's fun. Maybe it's a game. I'm going to get a whipping cream and shell. Right, hold on, hold on, hold on. So we have two balls. Okay, and then what do we have? Andrea wants to get one cotton candy. One, one, one cotton candy. Um, one cotton candy. Sunscreen. And oh. a glasses. And a sand castle. See? And pictures. Okay, Andrea, that's not the paper we're on. We're using the tickets. Look at your tickets. Oh, and then look look at your tickets. Hi, candy. Okay, and I wanna oh. eat I wanna see the turtle. I wanna see one turtle when I eat my cotton candy. Me right, too. We're going to add these up. So we have two, and we have one cotton candy. How many is that? How many is that, Ayat? Two, and one cotton candy. Three, and one visit to the turtle. How many tickets did I use to go see the turtle? I need my candy. Cotton candy, Ona. Yeah. Two turtles. Oh, only one turtle. We're not going to see both turtles. We only need one ticket. One oh, ticket. So cute. I got two turtles. I know, but how many? One turtle is sleeping, so we're not going to see him. How many tickets do we have here? It's this one. 
How many this tickets is, do we need? This is awake. Only this is awake. Yeah, so how many tickets do we need? I um, I at wanted to play get the ball prize. Yeah, I want candy. Four again. Two plus one is three. And one more makes four. We have four again. Oh my goodness. Four tickets. All right. Now I want you to count out five tickets. Any five you want. Put five in a pile. Everybody count five tickets. Five tickets. Four. Five. Very good. Okay, now I want you to take three of them away. Go pay for a, what, whatever you put in that pile. Pretend you went to visit one of the rides of the animals. Take three tickets away. That ride costs three tickets. So take three. I, I got two tickets now. Two tickets left. Good job. Good math. So that was five. I put, I put my three tickets under my chair. Awesome. And pretend this to end here's what it looks like when you ride it. Yeah, you five minus three. We took three tickets away. We went to see the animal or whatever ride we went on. We have two tickets left. Two tickets left. All right. Now, now how many other tickets is that? We've Go been ahead. be okay. Hold on. We've been behaving very well at the carnival. Our mom said she'll go buy more tickets. <gasps> so I want you to grab seven more. Grab seven more. We have two, but we're gonna get seven more. Okay. Count out seven. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven. Okay, let's add them together. I'm gonna point my camera down and show you. I'm gonna show you my camera with my. Well, I got seven. Okay, let's count them out. Two plus seven. seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, Phew, I got seven finally. Hold on, Andrea. You should have two from before. We're gonna, what we're gonna, we're doing two plus seven. Okay, so I have two at the top. I'm gonna add seven to that. Three, four, five, six, seven. So let's do the math. Let's add two plus seven. Two plus seven, Andrea. Two and then seven. Do you know how to do that? Let's count it. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine tickets. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. I still have seven. Okay, Andrea, that's great. You have seven. Good job. Awesome. But we were supposed to keep two that we had left from the previous one. We had two left over. And then our mom, our mom went and got more tickets. But now we have nine. Can you make sure you have nine? Nine. Yeah, get two more. Get two more and make sure you have nine. Ayat, how many do you have? I got two more. Okay, so do you have nine? We should have nine tickets. Line up nine tickets. Line up nine tickets. Here's, Here's my nine tickets on the paper. Okay, guys, you're doing awesome. This is good practice for when you count tickets at the carnival. You It's working on your math. Okay, we're getting nine tickets. And then, oh, I really want to watch the fireworks, and I want to have, um, oh, but my tickets have two. So I'm going to take two away from mine. How many you do I what, have? You know what prize I want? I want well, three away gets, and then I add one good get to one, one away makes two. Good job! That was awesome! I made that two! Okay, so how many do I have left? I just took two away. Oh. I have one, two. Three. I'll count it. Okay, one, count. two, three, four, five, six, seven! Awesome! Seven! Ooh, I still have a lot of tickets. How about I go see the um, lion?
Halloween show now. I'm going to take one away. How many would I have? If I had seven and I took one away. Six? Yeah, six. Good job. And then if I took, one, if I had six tickets and I take all of them away, how many do I have? None. Zero. Zero. If you had six tickets but you used them all up on the last ride or the last animal show, you would have zero left. And then what would happen? It would be time to go home, right? If you use all your tickets up, if you use all your tickets up at the ferry and your mom said, that's it, we're done. It's time to go home, right? What do you have another to say? Day. Yeah, another day. Uh, yeah, what do you have to My say? two days. Yeah, it's a lot of money to go. I know. And I have three kids. I have three kids at my house to take to the park. Yeah, how many? So I have three, and then I have one, two, three, four, and then I have five, and I have six, and I have seven. Awesome. So, and you took and five away? No, two away. Two away, seven, two away. Four, five. Awesome, you did great. Okay, girls, we're done with the tickets. You guys can use them to play store later. If you have a pretend kitchen, you can say, these are your money. These are great for, for pretend kitchen. Good, those are always fun. All right, now we're gonna do our cutting of our, our pattern, our summer pattern paper. All right. Like yeah, sure. I don't really know what you just said, but sure. So, there are a lot of tickets here. How do you think? Yeah. All right. So, here's the pattern. So, a pattern means that you have to look at the picture. So, my first one shows a beach ball, ice cream, beach ball, ice cream, beach ball. Beach. What will come next in the pattern? Ball. No, the ball and then the. Ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. All right. So the shapes are at the, cream. the shapes are at the bottom here. So let's cut along the rectangle at the, at the bottom. Can you cut along the rectangle at the bottom to cut the squares out? Ayat, you have your scissors, Ayat. Coloring. Oh, you're gonna color them. That's fine. I like that idea too. Good job. There's small pit. Oops, Miss Julie just ripped one. There's small pictures, so be careful. Are you using pencils? How are you, how are you gonna how are you gonna color them? Okay, so we're gonna put the ice cream at the first picture. I'm gonna use my glue stick to put the the ice cream down for the pattern. All right. The next one is. Ooh. Yeah, cut on the line, Andrea. Separate the squares. Yeah, separate the squares so you have the pictures. I oh, know, Bunch are cutting today. But that's okay. You guys can do it. You're good. Very easy. See? Cutting the squares apart. All right. All finished. Awesome. The next, the next one is sun, sun lotion. Sun sun lotion, sun, chin, lotion, yeah, so find out the one that looks the same picture, the lotion, the sun lotion, I hope you guys are putting that on when you go, oh, yeah. oh. sun lotion, are you wearing sun lotion when you go play outside, we can also do that, no, no, well, be careful so you don't get so skinny. It looks so hot. I really need sunscreen. Oh yeah, sunscreen. Yeah. Sunscreen. Good, yeah, sunscreen. That's what it's called. Yes, good job, guys. All right. The next row shows what? Seashells. Look at that at the beach. So seashell, seashell. Ooh, camera. That's a fun one. Seashell, seashell, 
camera. Yeah, camera. You can take pictures of the seashells at the beach. Or I like to take pictures all the time. I take pictures of my kids at the pool. I'm going to take pictures of us. We're going camping. We're going camping to the, and there's going to be a beach there. So I'm going to take lots of pictures coming up this weekend. Does your paper, does your paper look like this so far? You put the ice cream, the lotion, and the camera on it? No, it doesn't look. No. Are you matching them up? You're telling me the right pictures, Andrea. You're doing an awesome job. The pattern. We're working yeah. On, we're working because on the. I knew it. Awesome. The next I one. Know. Ooh. Watermelon, yummy treat. Watermelon, beach ball, beach ball. Watermelon, watermelon beach ball. It comes to watermelon. No, no, look at the pattern. One, two, one. Two. Two, so two beach balls. Look, watermelon, beach ball, beach ball. Watermelon, beach ball. Beach ball. Beach ball comes after the other beach ball. They tried to trick you on that one. They used two. I didn't know that one. Yeah, but it's okay. You're learning. And then there, oh, the last one. Oh, that's tricky. The last one's tricky. All right. What is the after What do we got? Sunglasses, ice cream, castle. Sunglasses, ice cream. Then come sunglasses, baby. Sand castle. Good job, I got sand castle. Sand castle. I have to. Get, I have to. I have to see if I have any sun sand castle stuff to build. Yeah. Yeah, I know I have a shovel, but I don't know if I have buckets or anything to build a sink castle at the beach. You know, I have a lot of buckets. Pink glue. Pink glue. Pink glue. I used yeah. to have some. It ran out. I had purple glue, too. All right, so the leftover one is the watermelon. You don't need this one. They tried, yeah. they tried to be tricky. You don't need the watermelon. I don't need it. Yeah. Okay. You need the watermelon after all. No, you don't need it. I finished my paper and I didn't use the watermelon. I didn't need it. All right. I didn't need it too. Right. Oh, you should put your name on your paper, especially if you want to show your parents your hard work. And and you can tell them about our math we did. Your favorite color, yeah. yeah. Okay. All right. I have a book to share. It's a summer book because we are in summer now. Today is oh no, we got a couple more days, so it's the first day of summer. But it's almost there. It's almost the first day. So let's see what they show you because they're going to show you some different pictures of summer in this book. Look at the front cover. Um. Those look good, don't they? Do those look good? Those popsicles? I know. We have popsicles for the beach. Awesome. What colors do you like? Um, we have orange. Yeah. What's your raspberry and that's it. Whoa. What's your favorite one? Um, strawberry. Ooh, I like and orange. orange and oh, you like a lot. <laughs> so this says. This is the front cover, and it says summer. That is what the word says, summer. That's the season. I don't have blue. I don't have blue. Oh, I'm sorry. Do you have tape? You could tape them on with your tape. tape on the what happened to your rainbow tape? Is it gone already? No. Oh, okay. Here's what it says. This is, let's see if any of these things you've already seen in summertime already. Oh, beautiful pictures. Summer days. In the summer, days are long. Oh, look at the beautiful sunflower. The sun sets late. Oh, these kids are having a great day outside. They're at, look, they're at the river. They're walking on the rocks in nature. That's a great picture in the summer. 
In summer, animals grow up. Moons teach the babies to fish. Oh, if you go to a pond, you may see baby animals. And they're learning to fish and swim. Yeah. That, that could be fun if you go to a pond. All right. Oh, my. What's this page say? In summer, spiders spin silky webs. Oh, a spider saves the bugs to eat later. Oh, my. Who likes spiders? Not me. No. But they do help us. They do help us. Nobody likes spiders. Yeah, there's somebody out there that likes spiders. Scientists. Yeah. Let's see what else they say. Yeah. Oh, my favorite. Look, growing vegetables and, and fruits. Summer. Plants grow. Ooh, they're growing a watermelon. Watermelon is ready to eat. Yum. Oh, you got to make sure. Yeah. They do that. You gotta make sure it gets to a big enough size to eat the watermelon before you pick it off the vine. So if you ever see watermelon, they have to be big enough to eat. Let's see what else they say about them. Yeah. Oh my, fancy mustache. Oh, see, like I see all these guys take a book outside. In the summertime, trees grow leaves and they make a shade. Jen stays cool in the shade. Look at that. The girl, boys and girls are outside reading their story. I could do that too. Yes, sure. oh, yeah, you have a rainbow mustache. Yeah, she's fancy Ayat today. You have a rainbow mustache. In the summer, it's hot. Uh-oh, their ice cream's melting. Meg drinks ice cream. <gasps> lemonade. Who likes lemonade? Me. Good, yeah, we do too. My house, we love it. The girl down the street's gonna have a lemonade stand. She told us at the pool. One of my, one of the little girls in our neighborhood is having a lemonade stand. Lemonade Oh, oh, look at this one. In summer, clouds, thunder, lightning flashes, and it rains. Ooh, sometimes there's summer storms, but you don't have to worry. It helps our plants grow. Ooh, this looks fun. Kids play. He plays t-ball and John swims at the lake. Oh, yes. Lots of different fun activities in the summer. Oh, for in summer, people camp. Oh, this girl, Eve, she sleeps in a tent. What do you do in the summer? <laughs> the tent. Yeah, she went camping. I'm going camping this coming weekend, but I'm not sleeping in a tent. We got a cabin because last time we went in the tent, hard ground, the rocks were sticking us in the back and the sticks were poking us. So we got a cabin this time. But we still are going to have a campfire and we're going to be outside and it'll be fun. Um, what do you like to do the best in the summer? Do you like to play games? Do you like to play games outside? Do you like to do? I like to play. How about you? I like to do a spy. Yeah. I spy. I spy. I spy is fun. I am. Guess what? We'll do that in the car ride driving to camping. We'll play I spy out the window. Do you do that when you're driving somewhere? I spy something pink. And we look and we look. Andrea, you could play this with your brother. I spy something sparkly. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. So that is a good game to play. You can play I spy outside in nature when you're driving, when you're at the grocery store. Lots of different what times you can play. He's big. He's only 11. I know. Those big kids, huh? What are your, what's your favorite thing to do in the summertime, Andrea? You already went to a fair. You already went to a carnival. What else do you like to do? I like going in swings. Oh, the park. Yay. You have a park right near you? Do you have a park by your pool? No, but I still have in my, I do have one slide. Oh, fun. Yeah, definitely go, to the, go visit a park. Who likes to go to the nature place and take a walk in nature? 
me. That's fun. That's a good one. And it doesn't cost any money or tickets. You just go take a walk and listen for the birds, maybe see some butterflies in nature.